Hello my beautiful Google Greeters! Can you believe it? This is my day 79 of the Open Heart 100 Day Challenge. It's been amazing. I, amazing is... It's been just pure love and light. Amazing gifts right and left. I just really am speechless and excited and definitely open hearted and being in the flow and feeling blessed and connected. Um, I just came back from a seven day retreat in Brittany with Diane Bellego. She's a French author. She doesn't offer unfortunately her her um, her seminars, but I want to share with you some of the insights that I got because it was amazing. The this one was on she's she's a tantra. She she does tantra, so there's a bit of tantra. But the main thing was for me the union of the personality and the soul and expressing that that vital inside energy and connecting really the soul and the personality together and we did so many exercises and and uh, rituals and dancing and um, letting the energy flow and partner exercises and just getting into the intimacy but not the sexual intimacy the really the the deep sincere vulnerable intimacy it was so great for me because I know that you know I have I have a challenge expressing that love and and my vulnerability in those moments and I was really able to identify my mechanism and that when I do that I just stop myself I don't want to say anything I just lock it up and so it's really physical and vocal and I can isolate myself and so it was it was really amazing to then see how I can access uh, and how I can shift in that moment the quickest way that energy and get back in it and I really got present to my sensitivity I, I, I cried the first day and the last day, not in between, even though if I had huge breakthroughs. But the first day was really expressing some of the fears that came up towards the group. So that was clear, and then I was fully in. And then the last day, because I, you know, you connect with so many people, and you can so much see their dream and the beauty of who they are. People, uh, people's heart open up and share their, 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 their on a soul level that it was just so moving and and I really got present more than ever to to my dream to really uh, help people to open their heart and to live fully their life to live their passion and what they're meant to live on this planet it was it was amazing to embrace the monster side of me if I can say that you know because I'm I'm tall and I always felt like oh I'm big and and really start to own that and even owning it and that angel part of me too so really bringing the two together uh, was was truly a beautiful experience and I, I feel like I'm in love with life and I feel really blessed to have experienced those seven days. I've never done a seven day retreat before because that's quite a commitment. And I also called my uh, my life partner. It was a very beautiful moment uh, of connection uh, with, with, I would say, Source, where I really uh, send my intention uh, in a in a powerful and undoubtful way, uh, it was really magnificent on many many levels, and um, I married my soul because <laughs> we did uh, the, the the whole thing was the union of the soul and the personality. So the last day we did a, a, a ritual a ceremony to marry our soul and our personality. So now I'm married with my soul. <laughs> and um, so many lovely things and I really realized through those exercises for example we had this exercise with uh, uh, being an animal and I was a leopard it, that's what came out and then we have 
we close our eyes, we were in the dark and with those music and really seeing and behaving like this animal and I really saw how effortless it can be and how when we work with our senses and we develop that and we develop those animal antennas just things show up in an effortless way and that's what life is about really tapping in this infinite potential and this unconditional love and we can do that I think by spending time in nature and now I'm gonna add by really letting those sounds, letting those tension, uh, allowing that energy to flow to, for example, this morning I went running and I just had some tension in my shoulder. So I just start, you know, running and shaking it at the same time. It didn't look good when I was running, but I didn't care. It was quite early and there was no one just shaking it and really doing those breathing exercises that we've learned, but just like, <sighs> just more heavily and running like that and then I felt better and better and then I stopped at some point uh, and and just and just followed the movement of my body and what it needed to say or express or shout and maybe like some mantras and enjoying that present moment and just amazing connection with the nature happened there and a feeling of c connecting and just allowing the soul to come in the body of course it's already there but to really feel it and and open my heart and connect it is just precious precious moment i think that is much needed especially with our virtual world and, and we spend so much time on the computer and and, and that that we really do, I think, have to come back to uh, tribes, you know, communities, getting together, spending time in nature, connecting to the animal side of us, breathing, just all those more primitive things to balance this, this virtual world. And that's something I'm taking on. Uh, as I said, it's been an amazing uh, 100 day challenge and we're only day 79 and um, now it's the weekend and, and I'm going to upload some more interviews that I'm doing and there's some in French, there's some in English. I'm living my dream. I cannot believe it. It's happening. It's unfolding. It's magnificent. G, 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 G. It's. I'm such at a different. I won't. I don't want to say level, but space in my life. It's things that happened this week, I couldn't have connected to that level, or I would have my ego would have been there, or I wouldn't have taken on things like that. I could see so much growth and such progress. And that, and it's I'm so present to the beauty of opening our heart and, and and able to cry and express my sensitivity. I'm really sensitive. Oh my God, and that's beautiful. And um, I feel very very thankful and blessed. And uh, I want to thank you for creating the space for for me to be able to express myself like I am and to be authentic and continue doing those videos even though if someone probably hacked it because all my videos are now less than one star but that just gives me even more strength and love uh, I know it's disturbing for some people to be with that love and positive message um, maybe something I said they took in the wrong way and I apologize for that if that's the case and um, but anyway, I'm very much empowered to continue more than ever along this path. And um, I'll be doing more and more videos. I send you much love. Bye, co-creator. Love you.